Now in this chapter I just want to go through the Azure Express Route service. Now this service allows you to extend a company's on-premise network onto the Microsoft Cloud by using a private connection that is provided by a connectivity provider. Now the connection allows you to connect onto Microsoft services such as Microsoft Azure and Office 365. Now the connectivity can be from any to any network, a point to point ethernet connection or through a virtual cross connection via an ethernet exchange. Now the connection uses layer 3 routing, your BGP is used to exchange routes between the on-premise network, the instances in Azure and Microsoft public IP addresses. So over here, I'm showing the pictorial representation of the Azure Express Route service. So I've gone ahead and taken this from the Microsoft documentation. Over here, you have the reference link. So the entire idea of Express Route is to go ahead and connect the customer's network onto either your Azure virtual network or onto public services such as Azure SQL databases, Azure storage accounts, or even Office 365. Now over here you actually have, have to go ahead and have hardware in place, the required hardware because all of this is basically flowing via a private network. So it's like having a established connection over a private link from your customer network onto Azure. And over here you have to go ahead and make use of various partner networks in place in order to go ahead and create something known as an express route circuit. From the perspective of the AZ-900 exam, it is just important to understand what is the entire idea of Azure Express Route. If you want to go ahead and connect your on-premise data center onto Azure, one of the ways you can go ahead and accomplish this is via Azure Express Route. The main difference over here is that it's like having a private link that does not go via the internet. So if you have data transfer that needs to be carried out between the customer network or let's say you have applications in the customer network that needs to interact with services in Azure, then instead of all of those traffic going via the internet and if you want to have a private and secure communication, you can go ahead and make use of Azure Express Route. Right, so this marks the end of this chapter wherein I just want to go ahead and give an overview of the Azure Express Route service. For more details, check the link in the description. Learn with Wits Labs. Success certified.